Good evening, you're watching the buck stops here. First, our latest story, the latest on the IPL controversy. Just how and why does the beleaguered BCCI president N. Srinivasan continue to enjoy the support of so many cricket associations despite allegations that his own son-in-law has been closely involved in the betting racket in the IPL? Well, they say it's all about big bucks, how state associations are dependent on the top brass of the BCCI for their annual payouts. Can anyone afford to take on Srinivasan and potentially ignore this payout? Well, that's one account of why Mr. Srinivasan is so strong. But joining us with his views, the Cricket Association of Bengal President and former BCCI President Jagmohan Dalmia. Mr. Dalmia, thank you very much for speaking to us. Sir, if there was a vote today, would you vote in favour of Mr. Srinivasan? To, or would you vote against him if he were asked to step down? I would not have done either way. <clears throat> Reason is that what is needed, a golden opportunity has come and what is needed is to clean the cricket. It's a golden opportunity and it should not be allowed to get uh, let go. So it is okay to clean now, cricket I, with, Mr. With, with Mr. Srinivasan at the helm of affairs. There is no clash in your opinion. No. What, <coughs> sorry. One coming forward, you are removing one, you are removing two or three. It is not that easy. It has come and made a, a big dent in the entire procedure and therefore it is necessary that it is to be cricket is to be cleaned uh, entertainment should be left to the entertainment part and one has got to be very strict uh, surveillance what about accountability sir what about accountability of mr srinivasan to millions of cricket fans in india and around the world there is a clash of interest over here at least till such time as all legal proceedings, whether it's the BCCI or otherwise, are completely sorted out with regard to his own son-in-law, why doesn't he step down? It is for him to decide and what, uh, how he is going to go ahead. And you support that, him in this decision, sir? Say. And you support him no, in this I'm decision? No, I'm not supporting it. No, I'm not supporting him at all. I'm saying I have not framed my opinion in this regard at this juncture because people are only to settle the score on one or two very uh, on uh, the firms. Now what is needed is that clean the cricket. What I mean by clean the cricket probably you may like to know. Yes sir, go what ahead. What I mean is offshore matches, masala matches, Toronto exhibition games which the board came forward and stopped those matches because there were chances of uh, some foul play. Removal of sleaze, cheerleaders ban. Sir, removal of sleaze, a cheerleaders ban, sir, but, but sir, we are talking about open blatant corruption over here. We are not talking about cheerleaders, I'm, I'm, sir. Allow me, allow me to complete it and you will know. I am not saying this is the final list, and but on such basis you can go ahead and try to bring a blueprint so in other words you are saying try sir, to remove so you are saying in other words since cheerleaders and 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 quote unquote uh, sleaze i mean in your own words and some of these aspects are so part of the ipl culture do you believe the ipl itself should be stopped if necessary and that is what needed for the shorter period whatever you need to uh, clean the cricket, you have to go ahead and if it is to be stopped for the time being, it has got to be stopped. Mr. Dalmia, this is breaking news it. right over here. What you are saying is very important. Jagmohan Dalmia, former president of the BCCI, president of the Cricket Association of Bengal says, if required, the IPL should be stopped. Is that correct, sir? Temporarily, uh, till the cricket is uh, cleaning operation is improved. And, by, and 
And sir, how long would that period be? I mean, who is to know whether it's clean or not? All cricketers, all administrators, all others, after all, this is what, uh, if we can't judge that it is a clean cricket or not, it is pity on our part. So therefore, Mr. Srinivasan should remain in his place, but the IPL for the moment should temporarily I'm be stopped. I'm not saying it. No, I'm not saying it. Uh, you are trying to bring as if we are meeting today to find out what Srinivasan is saying, what they are doing. If I would have known, I would have probably refrained because yes. your entire approach is uh, different. My point is, you have got a golden opportunity, uh, take it and go simultaneously with the cricket improvement. Have but you, sir, shared this opinion with Mr. Srinivasan? Have you told Mr. Srinivasan this is the golden opportunity to temporarily stop the IPL? I'm telling everybody, uh, whoever comes forward, I'm uh, telling this to everybody.